Hello everybody, my name is Matters, playing the games that matter, and a lot of people might not even know what this game is, but I decided to play it so you don't have to. This is Adventure Quest 3D. What the f- What the hell is this game? For those of you who don't know, a long time ago, and I mean a long time ago, when I was just a wee lad, not that I'm Irish or anything, but back when I was a wee lad, we heard talks of a game called Battleon.com. Now, Battleon.com was an interesting game. It was a Flash game that was a, believe it or not, a browser game where you just played. Almost like RuneScape, but somehow even worse than runescape the whole premise of this game was that you were some hero blah 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 you you kill things called like zorgs or whatever the i don't even know what they were frogs they were like frogs but like some of them shot lightning out of their asses or something like that i don't even remember the concept but what i do remember is that i enjoyed a lot of it and me and my friends used to go online play battleon.com and then go to school the next day and talk about all the weird shit that we did on battleon whether we got cool swords or whatever it was now this is basically a spiritual successor to battleon.com which i think used to actually be called adventure quest so just in case you were thinking about playing this game i'm gonna give you my opinion and tell you if it's actually worth playing and if it's not well, I guess you'll find out. So here we are in the character creator, um, of course, male and female, you know? For some reason, your character just punches the ground and creates an earthquake. I don't know why. There's something about old video games where they just make you as powerful as possible. You're the hero. Go and do the thing that heroes do, because that's what you do. Yeah, we got long hair? Yeah, this is what a... This is what a standard gamer living in their mom's basement looks like. We want to look like a hero, all right? We don't want to look like a fucking schlob. Just crawl out of his crawled out of his cave. What is this? This is like a, this is like what a gnome would look like. Anyway, skin color. I could probably be blue if I wanted to be, honest. You can be an albino. Nice. I knew it. You could be blue. You could even be fucking green. Yes. That's exactly what we wanted. We wanted to be green because that's, that's what I am. I'm green. I'm like the green goblin. Except the only thing I, I be goblin is dick glizzies. And we're going to name ourselves matters. And let's create that. Let's log into the server and see how this goes. Click mouse and drag. Okay. We have successfully... Look at that. We're doing it. We're playing the game. So this looks like a fucking MMO or some shit. Oh my god. Whoa. Look at that, that flip. Okay, we got sword. It's cool. Weapon slots? Okay. We did it. Success. New stats. Wow, I leveled up already. That's fantastic. Cool. We are going to be so strong when we leave this first cave. It's going to be insane. Wow. I will defeat all the emaciated human beings who sadly died and passed away, and now I'm killing them for a second time. Not only did they experience pain in their first life, now they're experiencing pain in their second life. That's what I'm here for, like this guy. He's gonna die. Now they're making him big to make me think that I should be scared of him. But as we all know in tutorials, it doesn't matter. I could still kick his ass. And that's exactly what we're going to do. We're just gonna click on every button possible. Wow, I've leveled up, amazing. Actually, you know what? There's one thing that I do remember about this game. When you died, you actually went to death and you got to make some sort of bargain with him. What's with the grim look? Uh, am I dead? Yes, you have been dead a long time. This is a, an insane backstory, guys. We are learning that we are actually fucking dead. But I can restore you to the land of the living for a favor. See, this is what I'm talking about, guys. This is what death always does. He always tried to be bargaining with you. He's like, yo, dog, you suck my D, you can go for free. But if you don't suck my D, you're gonna have to pay. What kind of a favor? Yeah, this is where we get into the bad stuff. Someone has taken the key to the land of the dead. I need you to get it back. Huh. What? Wait, death is locked out of the land of the dead? Don't rub it in. So what if... So if I find this vain guy and retrieve your stupid key, you'll be bringing me back to life? Yeah, sure, whatever. Just go get my key. So he's got a squatter in his house and I'm just here to take him out. <laughs> You know who I am? In your first life, you were a legend, but that was long ago. People no longer sing songs of your day.
Psych! We're not dead, you dumbass. What, you think we were gonna die just like that? I will make you wish you could die. <laughs> Dude. The king no longer serves death, and this world is bound for the void. I can't kill you yet, but you are powerless to stop me. See for yourself. This guy's just. <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> Dog. <laughs> what the? What is happening in this game? Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. We're still going. And. Where are we going to next? Over the river and through the woods. Grandmother's house. Go. Adventure Quest 3D. What an epic intro. I summoned from the void the one who prophesies to destroy the world. What the? Excuse me? Do either of you know the way back to Death's Lair? Do Truly, this warrior has seen Vane the Void King with their own eyes. Big guy, black armor, sour disposition. Yeah, I met him. Then you are a witness to his glory. Join us. Join the Void Draker. Who the fuck are you? Uh. <laughs> wow. So. Well, as I can tell, guys, this, this is, um, this is it. We, this is the game. There's actually a human being playing this right now named Horror, Horror Ice. From what I can tell in this game, it's basically what Battle On used to be, which is almost like a campy comedy RPG online MMO. Kind of boring, honestly. Art style is interesting, but honestly, I've played this before. This is not my first time playing this. And the last time I played this, I only played this for about two hours. This time, I feel like I already know what I'm getting into, which is going to be a bunch of fetch quests and a bunch of kill quests. No vi villager fights like that. Who are you? I matters. You're a fucking goddamn hero. What? I'm a hero? Yeah, dude. Like, you could totally, like, kill everybody. What? Huh? Tell me how I can help. Yeah, you know, just like kill people and stuff. You know, maybe go like do that. Yeah, sure, I'm on it. Okay, what's my next? Cool. V rescue villagers. Fantastic. I really sure do feel like a hero. I feel like I've never done this in any other video game I've ever done before. It's fantastic. In fact, I think that um, this this is a good game. Guys, I, th I recommend everybody play this. Um, what was this game called again? Anyways, click the like button. Subscribe if you're new. I will be playing more games to let you know if they suck thing or if they are good thing. Okay? So. So, yeah.